The Edge program has been hitting the bullseye of what people are interested in. Do you feel like I do? We're now broadcasting 24 hours a day, 7 days a week from the new EBN, the Edge Broadcasting Network. We've added a web store. We're making a difference in the search for truth. And we're sharing our success with you. Do you feel like I do? From around the world, people are listening. They're sending in their stories and comments. They're making guest suggestions. They're telling their friends about the show. Do you feel like I do? Listen every Saturday night, 8 to 10 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, and feel like I do, right here on this station. You're listening to the Edge Radio Program, a show so hot, your radio might catch on fire. Political and religious news, supernatural happenings, unexplained mysteries, conspiracy theories, and special guests along with your calls right here on the Edge Radio Broadcast with your host, Daniel Ott. Love is viewed by some as a sign of passive weakness in the face of adversity. Love is a common language experienced by all nature. This one conception is felt by the sparrows that nurture their hatchlings in the spring to the human parents who protect their offspring. Love is the energy that spawns the will to protect beyond all else. She can be as calm and peaceful as the sweetest of summer breezes, yet in that same instant she can be as ferocious as a raging storm. She can warm and soothe like the glowing embers of a winter fire, yet in that same instant her flames can burn and maim like a raging wildfire. There is no greater danger than love, especially when that love is disturbed. Love is the protector, it is nature's ward. Beware love's shield when it becomes a sword. One underestimates love at their peril, as love is not some insidious, all-encompassing blanket that smothers and chokes. Love is, and always will be, a weapon of mass protection, for love is the ammunition of the heart that can strike a blow in the hearts of those who do not understand its nature. When next I walk in the wild wood, I will ask the Creator to blow you all a gentle breeze of refreshing love, so that when you next inhale your spiritual air, you may understand that this person has treated you with the love and respect you deserve. When next I traverse the rocky edges near my home, I will ask the Creator to send you all an exquisite white cloud of beauty so that when you next look to the heavens your faces may be refreshed by a gentle falling rain and understand that this person cries tears of joy when meeting new friends. When next I stroll upon my local riverbank I will ask the Creator to forge you all a calming seafaring current of friendship so that when its waters next meet the ocean my respect and love for you all will be washed upon your distant shores. Welcome back, my name is Andy Radford here in the Edge's UK studio and you're listening to and watching Edge Thursday Reports. That wraps up the show for this week and I would like to thank Edge correspondent Gina Romano and her guest Galan, author of Defining America, Vic Connor and Edge correspondent CM Leslie. 
More information about this show and all the subjects covered can be found on the Edge's UK studio page. Just go to www.theedgeam.com and click the link for the UK studio. The audio and video archives of this show will be posted on Friday. And don't forget, all the Edge show archives are free to download and share with as many people as you want. Don't forget to tune in to Daniel Ott's live show this Saturday night at 8pm Eastern Standard Time and this will be the 26th of July 2008 and on the 27th of July 2008 on the Sunday 8pm Eastern Standard Time Larry Cap hosts Spiritually Speaking. If you want to become involved with any of the Edge TV channels get in touch with us here at theedgeam.com. My name is Andy Radford, your host for the Edge Thursday Reports, coming to you from the Edge's UK studio. And until next week, goodbye.